In today's video, we're going to discuss the rumors surrounding Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker and how many are speculating whether or not the pair are engaged. If you want to know more about this breaking news, make sure to stick around till the end. Along with this, we will also delve into Billie Eilish and how she has recently commented on how she feels about her past comments that have recently surfaced. But before we get into the video, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on so you don't miss any of the new videos we post. Newly engaged couple rumors, Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker. Fans believe Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker are engaged after returning from a romantic trip to Vegas that included a lot of weird vampire references. Which, maybe? To be honest, there's a lot of evidence to go through here, so let's get started. Now I understand why people tie the knot in Vegas. Hairstylist Glenn Oropesa reportedly remarked with a series of images from Court and Travis's Vegas trip. Nothing compares to love and a good time. What's more, a diamond ring emoji was used in the original post, but it was afterwards replaced with a heart. Quite intriguing. Alum of Keeping Up with the Kardashians shared a selfie of herself with a large diamond on her ring finger, and has sparked engagement rumors with Travis Barker. The couple have only been together for a year and are reportedly discussing marriage. Courtney and Travis have been photographed on multiple romantic dates in the last six months, some just the two of them and others with their children. The reality star and the Blink-182 drummer both uploaded Instagram images at Kris Jenner's Palm Springs home in early January 2021, sparking rumors of an alleged romance. Travis, on the other hand, was caught on many occasions writing romantic remarks on Courtney's social media posts prior to the images. Two days after Valentine's Day, the mother of three confirmed their romance with a romantic photo of the couple hand in hand, and it's possible that the couple is already engaged. Kourtney Kardashian posted a series of images to her Instagram account on Thursday to promote her sister Khloe Kardashian's clothing company, Good American. It's clear that Kourtney is wearing a big diamond ring on her ring finger in the photographs, but it's uncertain which hand it's on because photos can flip. Coming soon, the 42-year-old captioned the photo, tagging her sister's business in the process. Her nails may have been neatly manicured, but the focus on her finger is drawn to the big gemstone. The ring finger, you guys, one admirer commented in the comments area besides a red love emoji. That ring, though, said another. Other admirers just used the diamond ring emoji in their comments. Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker see a future together. Kourtney Kardashian and Travis Barker aren't planning on getting married anytime soon, but a long-term relationship is a probable option, according to a source who spoke to Entertainment Tonight. Kardashian and Barker began dating in early 2021 and have shared numerous images of their relationship, including Kardashian tattooing Barker with a I love you tattoo. A source close to the pair told Entertainment Tonight, Kourtney and Travis really recognize now more more than ever how special their relationship is and how fortunate they are to spend their time together, whether it's just the two of them, with friends or with their families. They could also definitely see themselves ending up together one day, and it's really whatever makes Courtney happy. Right now, though, they're just living in the moment and enjoying each day. Many, along with myself, were quite confused when the pair first started posting together. I think it caught many people off guard, but the pair have definitely made for a great couple. When did the pair start hanging out. In January 2021, when Courtney uploaded a photo on Instagram and Travis couldn't help but respond, we got our first peek of Kravis. While he just replied with a rose emoji, it's difficult not to read into that today. When they both posted the same lovely view from Kris Jenner's property in Palm Springs, they hinted that they were spending time together. We got our first confirmation of the couple just a day after they shared matching Palm Springs photos on their feeds. Courtney tweeted a nighttime photo photo of the pool on her feed. Courtney and Travis are officially a couple, Us Weekly stated, with people adding that they had been dating for a month or two at the time. In February 2021, for their first Valentine's Day together, the new couple appeared to keep things low-key. Courtney shared a photo of a cozy-looking fireplace on Instagram, hinting at their upcoming celebrations. In the most understated way, Courtney and Travis got Instagram official. 
While the snapshot of Courtney holding Travis's hand is simple, it tells Travis fans everything they need to know. In March 2021, Courtney dropped the L word with Travis sharing a handwritten note from Courtney on his Instagram. In April 2021, for a journey to Deer Valley, Utah, Travis and his family joined forces. The couple and their children went skiing together and appeared to have a fantastic time. Travis and Courtney have continued to show their love for each other. The 18th of April, Travis, unsurprisingly, went all out for Court's birthday post, which included a photo of the two kissing as well as a video of her sucking his thumb. Fast forward to the present day, the pair seem inseparable and very much in love. When asked about marriage and all of that, Courtney had this to say. Getting engaged and married one day has definitely been a topic of conversation between Courtney and Travis, a source told the outlet. Travis would absolutely love to tie the knot with Courtney, but Courtney hasn't been sure that's the step she wants to take in their relationship right now. She's extraordinarily happy and doesn't feel the need or want the pressure of getting married. There are a lot of other factors that concern her if they were to take their relationship to that next level, one of them being Scott Disick, and more importantly, her kids, and what that adjustment would mean for them. It could be a lot to process, even though everyone sees that Courtney is undeniably in love with Travis. Courtney sees herself loving this moment and is just taking everything one day at a time and enjoying their time together. Billie Eilish and how she feels ashamed about her past racial comments. The 19-year-old singer was recently embroiled in controversy after a video from her early teens showed her listening to Tyler, the creator's 2011 hit, Fish, while mouthing a racist slur and speaking in a gibberish accent. She admitted she's incredibly embarrassed about her previous behavior, though she insisted she's no different than anyone else when it comes to regretting the past. She told Australia's Vogue magazine, It's really weird how the world can see every aspect of your life and reminisce about it. It's so weird. The internet brings up things from everybody's past, and I'm like, don't you guys understand that everybody is incredibly embarrassed and ashamed about their past? Like, do you not think about the fact that maybe you're embarrassed of your past, so maybe everybody else is embarrassed too? However, when it came to her saying the racial slur and her response to those who were offended by her words, she wrote, I love you guys, and many of you have been asking me to address this. Billy shared on Instagram stories at the time, and this is something that I want to address because I'm being labeled something that I am not. There's a video edit going around of me when I was 13 or 14 where I mouthed a word from a song that at the time I didn't know was a derogatory term and used against members of the Asian community. She continued, I am appalled and embarrassed and want to barf that I ever mouthed along to that word. This song was the only time I'd ever heard that word as it was never used around me by anyone in my family. Regardless of my ignorance and age at the time, nothing excuses the fact that it was hurtful and for that I I am sorry. The other video in that edited clip is me speaking in my silly, gibberish, made-up voice. Something I started doing as a kid and have done my whole life when talking to my pets, friends, and family. It is absolute gibberish and just me goofing around and is in no way an imitation of anyone or any language, accent, or culture in the slightest. Anyone who knows me has seen me goofing around with voices my whole life. Regardless of how it was interpreted, I did not mean for any of my actions to have caused hurt to others and it absolutely breaks my heart that it is being labeled now in a way that might cause pain to people hearing it. I not only believe in, but have always worked hard to use my platform to fight for inclusion, kindness, tolerance, equity, and equality. We all need to continue having conversations, listening, and learning. I hear you and I love you. Thank you for taking the time to read this. Wow, sorry that was a mouthful, but you can tell it very much impacted Eilish significantly along with her fans and those who support her. And there you have it. Everything you need to know about the rumors surrounding Kourtney Kardashian and her apparent new engagement to boyfriend Travis Barker. Along with this, we also delved into the recent controversy surrounding Billie Eilish and a response to upset and hurt fans. We would love to hear your thoughts in the comments below on the topics. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like and subscribe so you never miss any of our new and upcoming content. Thanks for watching.